great surge by the, the, the linebackers of Notre Dame. 49, Mike Kovaleski comes right through the gap, fights off a blocker, and puts a stop on Ryan Knight. Third and three, unusual call. He took Steele on, too, who's been blocking exceptionally well today. Here's Chris Spurl's punt, nice and high. Tim Brown is back at the 28. He's got a wall. This is Timmy Brown, the number three all-purpose carrier in the nation. Turns the corner, gets blocking, gets the wall, and takes the ball as, as only Timmy Brown can do it, and puts Notre Dame in position to win this football game because they're already in field goal area. That's a 56-yard punt return, and we'll watch it from the end zone. Tim Tolner said he did not want, he wanted to prevent Tim Brown from making big plays today. Well, he's made two or three of them. He's made him in the passing game. He's made him in the kickoff returns and here in the punt return. A terrific wall set up by the Fighting Irish. And Tim Brown just does a marvelous job of getting his team in position to win the football game. The punter, Chris Spurl, made the tackle and is injured. Tim Brown, 25 touchdowns in his high school career and an average length of those touchdowns, this is incredible, of 45.9 yards. <laughs> Woodrow Wilson High School in Dallas, a shot. Ted Tolner looks on. His team led earlier in this quarter, 37 to 20. Four minutes ago, they had fourth and a foot at the Irish five. And you think he isn't thinking about that play? That was a key, key play down there. And go back to the two-point conversion that put them within two in this game. Andy Heck right here will slow block and then break over the middle. Right here, he's lined up at the tight end spot. He'll slow block right here and then he'll break into the scene. But it appeared that Berline was throwing, I think it was to the fullback or it was to Mark Green, but watch Heck step right inside in front of Mark Green right there and make the second effort to get into that end zone they're not going to keep him out and he gets the two-point play which puts him in a position to win with a field goal the punter chris pearl who saved the touchdown with a tackle of tim brown is still down at the 20-yard line 37 35 and watch once again tim brown in action well you could see it from up here it was beautifully laid out it was coming right to our press box you can see that when that tackle was missed right there you knew brown had a wall here and he got the kind of speed to do the job. And here he comes up the sideline. Look at the speed that he has. Carney comes off of that. Makes good judgment there. And of course, there's the, there's the tackle. And there's also where he got hurt. Schaefer got hurt. He's okay. He's walking off. No, that, yeah, he's Spurl. walking off. Spurl, I'm sorry. Chris Spurl walking off with some degree of assistance. John Carney is the all-time field goal leader. Now